We rented a house here in Skegness because we had more than three days off and it just is better for us to live in an environment that feels like home because we can make our own food. There's a lot of fried food here and especially Mark and I are just dying for a salad. So I found this beautiful home. So I'm going to give you a little view of it. This is actually on the third floor, which is odd. This is the kitchen and the dining room and um, the living room, which has been taken over by all the merch that I am single-handedly folding because I'm the girl in the band, so I get that job. So I've done these two boxes. I've done all these hoodies, all these tees, but there's freaking three more huge boxes right here that need to be done. This is the church where Graham's which niece got married and where his parents are buried. It's so beautiful. It's funny when you come to England and you see structures that are thousands of years old and the locals don't even take notice of that, but our country is so young that I'm just fascinated by this. This is Graham's parents' final resting place. This is um, in an absolutely gorgeous setting. It's a little cold right now, so I don't think you can really appreciate just how beautiful it really is around here. That was Lou and Reed, and I'm so sorry I never got to meet them. And here we are at the supermarket. Bethany has uh, found us a very nice house for the next three days. We're here in Skegness, Graham's home hometown. Rehearsing, to re rehearsing tomorrow. Say hello, Graham. Hello, Graham. There he is. So we're getting some groceries in. And here we are at dinner in Skegness is the house, the <laughs> aforementioned house. We were at the supermarket and we purchased the f groceries. <laughs> Purchase the person here. <laughs> no, and Con 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 Conrad has made us a wonderful again as always meal. Mm. I've eaten one plate. I'm already on my second plate. Pasta with dairy free, gluten free pasta with dairy free pesto. <laughs> we with uh, broccoli and mushrooms. Very nice. Thank you, Conrad. Here we are in Skegness, and as you can see, they're loading in a PA. Very nice, very professional. Unloading cases. Should be a pretty rocking show tonight. A lot of phone calls, a lot of pre-sales. Rams hometown. Guaranteed to be a stellar night. here? I think this is Steve. This is Steve Hardy. Um, he's uh, a guy that I've worked with ever since I was probably about 15 years old in our first band. Well, I think it was 15 or 16. Wow, yeah. yeah. Uh, do you guys used to play here? Yeah, this, this, this place, the Suncastle, we played here 49 years ago and uh, it's kind of incredible to come back here and play on the same stage because I thought it was a lot smaller than it is. Yeah. Something like that. Hello, this is my school, slightly different from the days uh, when I was there, it's been built onto and it's now called the Skegness Academy, it was called the Morris Secondary School and uh, I was there for four years and it was a hell of a sentence, I couldn't wait to get out of there, it was great. Was it a life sentence? It was a life sentence. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Hi Paula. Hi Paula. Hi Paula. Hey. Hi Lily. Hi Lily. How are you okay. darling? Hi oh, sweetheart. The family's here. I can't oh, see yeah. you. Oh. I can, but I've got the wrong glasses. Okay. I am the worst camera person. This is what you've been wanting to Oh, right, yeah. Okay, I'm filming this. Hi, oh, sweetheart. Hello. Right. Hello. Hello, darling. This is your Hey, Graham. Mm hmm. What was your favorite band you've ever been in? What are you doing? <laughs> I'm asking you a question. Your favorite band I've ever been in? Yeah. This one. Good answer. Thank you. And here we have Graham, Graham, Graham Bonnet's pre-show piss. He has a bucket tonight. So once again, there's no backstage toilet. Now we have and I gotta you know go. the Mark Zonda piss. He, he might, 
but it was really uncool. I'd step around and the same. No like, backstage bathroom equals. Have bottles all around the fucking dressing. <laughs> Any words for your? Uh, hometown, I wish there was a toilet. Hometown friends. <laughs> I, wish there was a toilet. I can't hear a damn thing. Any, I haven't turned this on. Any words for your hometown friends? Well, it's good to be back, and I hope everything goes good tonight. And it, it's just incredible to see my relatives, my cousin I haven't seen for nine and a half thousand years, nine hundred thousand years. I'm drooling. I'm sorry. Uh, I played here 49 years ago, and um, it's really strange to be here, but it's kind of cool. <laughs> Just uh, witnessed an epic gig by Graham Bonnet Band. Um, it's Graham's hometown, so it's very emotional. Um, unbelievable, unbelievably brilliant. Down to Earth album by Rainbow, which uh, Graham Bonnet was a vocalist on since he'd been gone and all night long. And loves no friend of mine. God, my absolute favourite. Is why I'm a musician and a singer. It's pretty much. Um, he's inspired me all the way along, vocally, and just as a person, most amazing person. Absolutely awesome, and tonight has made me so welcome. I am truly thankful. Thank you very, very much. <laughs> So today we discovered we've lost a headlight. One of the headlights is broken, so we cannot continue until we've replaced it. Obviously we can't travel at night with just one operational headlight. So we are, after a little bit of research, we found ourselves here at Euro Car Parts. Any part for any car, which is quite a big statement. So let's see if they can get us on the road again. So the end of our arduous saga of finding a bulb for the van has now ended and it was two pounds, three pence. And where did we find it? I have no freaking clue. Somewhere in Euro car parts in Carlisle, Cumbria. Deepest Cumbria. Yeah, deep in Cumbria. Um, yeah, it's all good. What do you think, Graham? I'm I'm not. I try not to. We have we have we have a new bulb. <laughs> Probably one of the greatest underrated vocalists this country has ever produced. It's been a great pleasure to meet him. It's a great pleasure to meet all of you. And uh, you've really taken care of me. And Graham, very kindly, signed that for my brother, who couldn't make it tonight. He signed that for myself, 
rainbow vest of a Japanese import. Ha 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 ha. And the first Alcatraz album. We'll hide that because it's about, it's about Graham and not Yang Win. What that there is, is not trying to take just moving pictures like you want. Yeah, it's moving pictures. Oh. <laughs> Alright then. Yeah, thank you, Graham. Thank you. You take care. Yeah. tell you about a hazard of being a female in a rock band. Notice my eyelash is coming off. Um, kind of running into problems where there's no risers. Uh, some of the stages are a little small, but still there's been a couple that are pretty good and there's just no risers. Not really a big Bill Ward, Black Sabbath, play on the floor type of guy, but I love playing with this band. The songs are great. Graham sounding great. So I kind of just uh, have to deal with it. So. Great tour, everything's going great, but I really can't stand playing on the floor. It's all I could think about while I was playing tonight. I was hitting bad notes because I couldn't take my mind off my freaking eyelash. <laughs> I'm asking you for your take on it. What really happened in Sheffield, the gig with Michael Schenker, where you got canned, what happened? Only that my penis came out of my pants and I started to run to the audience and tell them to talk off. Okay, so did, did your penis come out on its own, or did you? No, I, I encouraged it. You did encourage it. It was a bit like getting a turtle out of a shell, you know. I you coaxed it out. No, I did. Yeah, okay. You coaxed the penis out, and then once it was out, I swung it. <laughs> and um. Trying to get to the gig in Glasgow. Turn right on Holland Street, then turn right on South Okay. Street. As you can see, the police have blocked yeah, our access to the show. We cannot access the venue due to the due to the police due to the police roadblock. Countryman, and was, well, it wasn't actually in Los Angeles, uh, Jimmy Bain, and uh, I'd like to salute him. He was a former member of Rainbow. So, <laughs> yeah. Here we are in Newcastle at the O2 Academy. It's an early show tonight. Graham's currently doing some uh, radio interviews right now. Let's go take a look. In any particular category of music. <laughs> is it difficult to think that you've been in the music business now since the 60s? Mm. It is because that's about uh, when I started in 68, that's my age now. You know, and, and, you know, I'm 68 now. I was probably 19 back then or something silly yeah. and uh, it was uh, it's been a long trip I can tell you you know and uh, to see musicals you know styles change and whatever else you know I've been through every kind of era and picked up a little bit from every year or two add to my music now yeah. it's, uh, it's a long road Anna is the, uh, the singer a very good singer too of our support band for the whole tour, Evil Tide. Awesome. There we go. Do you have a few words? What's uh, it like touring with the Grand Bonnet Band? It's been amazing actually. Um, really? This is the biggest tour we've ever done and just to be able to play with Gary it's just amazing. I've been singing Rainbow Songs since I was like two, so to actually be here with the man is just... It's been cool. It's been tiring. 
but we're having a really awesome time. Good laugh, great people. Awesome. Toilet bed, isn't it? It's towel. Really? I'd like to see the ass that accommodates this toilet paper. And here yeah. we are. <laughs> it's a very early show today, as I said earlier. So one of the perks of the early show is getting changed at the venue, in the dressing room. Bethany, would you like to give us a tour? Yes, um, here we have, uh, as Graham calls it, the shitter. And then here we have the sink, which when someone's on the shitter, Graham uses as the pisser. <laughs> Sorry, honey. It's really under the bus. So it's not only bottles. No, it's any port in a storm. Graham is the pisser. I don't know where I'm going to put this stuff. Then you're doing your makeup in here tonight? I'm going to have to do my makeup, but I have nowhere to put it. Tim, the merch man. We have a lovely selection of hoodies. T shirts. Alcatraz CDs, signed photos. All at a very affordable prices. Driving down the, we we're driving down the motorway. I wanted to just go to the side of the road so we can open the door and turn on the heater. So people were getting cold in the van, and the side of the road had a lot of mud, and I didn't see it, so we got stuck in the mud. All right, so right now, I wonder if we have to unload the. the we have it. we have the van stuck in mud. Side of 